and we've scored some real successes for Ontarians, whether you're talking about uh, the number of people who now have access to a family doctor, reducing wait times, and getting down the incidence of smoking, all those things that are so important to all our families. But what I'm asking our doctors to understand, and in fact our 1.3 million uh, extended public servants who are working in the BPS, that we find ourselves at a very challenging time in our economy and that uh, our choice is as much as possible to protect jobs in the public sector and to hit the pause button for a couple of years so that we can uh, continue to fund uh, growth in public services. So I'd rather continue to expand full-day kindergarten than expand teacher salaries at this point in time. I'd rather expand home care and further reductions in wait times than expand doctor salaries. Now had we hit the pause button for the first eight years, it'd be a different story. But the fact of the matter is that every single year in the public sector, we have found ways to strengthen the compensation packages for our partners. That's as a, that was in keeping with the times. Now we find ourselves in different times. You're asking them now, but you're going to have to tell them sooner or later, and probably sooner you're going to have to tell them. Well, I remain optimistic, and I think we've been pretty clear in our budget that um, there is no money available for new agreements. We're going to have to hit the pause button for a couple of years.